Welcome to 5 Minute Netbeam 7.2, Part 2. Last time we installed Netbeam 7.2 together, today let's create a simple project using Netbeams. Click this button that shows to that, that says New Project. Select Java in the Categories and select Java Applications. Click Next. Let's give our first project name called um, Hello World, which is usually the first program you create when you're learning any language. It's Hello World. Whether you're learning Java, C++, or Python, normally you would start by creating a Hello World um, program. So that's just click Finished. By the way, this project will be saved under this user or, or whatever path that's in project locations. And the main class will be in hello world dot hello world. This is a hello world is a package name and the second hello world is a class name. So click finish. This is a program just created for us by NetBeans, and there's just one source file. It's called hello world.java. We double click it, it will, at this editor, the co editor, you would see the code for hello world class. You see, and to have it do something, I'd assume that you know a bit about Java or about programming, but even if you don't, you can still follow this tutorial. So let's type system. And Nebbin has the context of where drop down the, or what I call context of where um, hints. So when you type system dot, it's going to give you a list of all, all the available methods and attributes. That you can use so I'm going to use dot out just print to the standard output and print ln which stands for print line I'm going to say hello world end it with by the way you see that there's squiggling lines squiggling red line that means that there is syntax error programmatical syntax error in this line so the error is you're missing a semicolon. To save, click this button or click Control S or if you're on Mac like me, click the Command button and Command S. To run it, you could simply click this Run button and you see that in the output panel, it says hello world so we successfully run it and to change it a bit you can add hello world Jessica say hi to me so and then again hit save and run again now instead of the hello world it says hello world Jessica this concludes today's lessons if you have any questions please leave me a comment I'll see you next time bye